security do now. Okay, so we have six F. Okay, so solutions elementary going wild. Okay, so writing a postcard, I can write a postcard. So we have here the word Sarah Absail, cycle, kayak, surf, trick, and explore. Okay. So here, Sarah, we have here the different activity. Can you match, Sarah, what do you think are the names of the activity? I'm finished. Okay, so we have trick kayak and abseil trick kayak and abseil so which of these sports sarah is you think your favorite um maybe uh check it is check okay trick you like trick Okay, so here, Sarah, we have here two, you have here two activity, okay, two postcard, the postcard one and the postcard two. Okay, so in the first card one, it is about the letter of Mila to Sam. And the second one, it is the letter of Tom to Duan. <coughs> okay. Now, Sarah, please look at Postcard one. Okay. Task three. Please answer postcard one for me. Okay. Please answer. Okay.
I'm finished, Dijan. Okay. Which country do you think is the writer in? Okay. Vietnam. Yeah. Very good. And where mm -hmm. is she staying? She's in the... Very good. Who's out? And what's the weather like? Very Hot and sunny. Hot and sunny. <clears throat> what activity did he or she do yesterday? Okay. It is... And exploring. Trick and explored. And what activity is he or she planning to do? Traveling to the beach and stuff. Surfing. Okay. Traveling to the beach, of course. And surfing, teacher Anne. Yay. Hey, great job. So this one. Okay, the second task is from Tom to Joanna. Okay, so which country is Tom in? Tom is from, sorry, Tom is from Canada. Yeah, okay, where he or she stay? At a campsite. Okay, what's the weather like? It's okay. Windy and yesterday it's better today. What activities did he or she do? It's kayak head. And what activities is he she planning to do? It is cycling. Cycling. Okay. Cycling. Okay, so next one, Sarah. So we have here Sarah about. Okay. So here's Sarah in task six. 
Imagine you are on the adventure holiday. Plan a postcard. Make notes and include the in following information. So you will make a postcard, Sarah, like the one you had you had seen. The one, the first one, that dear Sam, like that the postcard. And please use the information. This one, country, weather, activities that you do, and when you did them, activities you are planning to do. Okay, You make your own postcard. Okay, Sarah, go. Okay. Bye bye không mắm giờ chị đi rồi không bật bật không sao vậy à à nhập tập yoga không có bạc chứ số hai rồi á
<clears throat> okay, so where is it? Uh, let me see. Let me read your mm. I saw me trick and explored in the forest with my family. It's a little tired, but still fun. Then today we have swim in the beach. I enjoyed it very much. Sarah, you can use the word. I enjoyed it very much. Do not say, Sarah, I very enjoy. Okay, please take note. You can say, I enjoyed it very, very much. Okay, so now we're planning to cycling along the park near the beach. It will be very fun and relaxed. I cannot wait for that. Okay, so Sarah, your answer is correct. Okay, only few. I'm on vacation with my family in America. We are now in a hostel near the beach. Yesterday, I do... I cycled along the park. Sarah, yesterday, I, because of the word yesterday, I cycled, I cycled along the park near the beach. It will be very fun and relaxing. Okay, relaxing. Very fun. And relaxing. It will be very fun and relaxing. Okay. I enjoy it very much. Now we're planning. Okay. So it will be very fun and relaxing. I cannot wait for it. Okay. Very good, Sarah. Please use the past tense of the verb because we are talking here the past tense. Okay. You said yesterday, of course, you will have to say cycled. Okay, write your postcard. Use your notes from task 6, including activities from task 1, phrases from task 5, and the tenses mentioned in writing strategy. Okay. So that is your... You already have your task. Okay. So, Sarah, we are done with unit 6F. Six, six okay. So let us have another activity, Sarah. Okay. Yeah. So we are done with Unit 6F. And let us move to listening 
Okay, so we have vocabulary. We have the word purse. Okay, this one, Sarah. Next, Sarah, we have traffic jam. Next, we have spot. And plane. And tunnel. Okay, so this is the tunnel. Okay, this is the tunnel. The plane, the spot. The traffic jam. Okay, please listen, Sarah, for pet 3.1. Ready, Sarah? Yes. Now we are ready to start. Excuse me, Sarah. Listen carefully. You will hear each recording twice. One. What was in the woman's bag? Was there anything valuable in the bag that was stolen, madam? Yes. It had my purse in it and my keys. Anything else? Well, luckily I was wearing my glasses, so no, nothing else. Now listen again. Was there anything valuable in the bag that was stolen, madam? Yes. It had my purse in it and my keys. Anything else? Well, luckily I was wearing my glasses, so no, nothing else. Two. Which film is the man talking about? I'm sure I've seen this film before. That bit where she's standing on the bridge watching the sunset reminded me. Now listen again. I'm sure I've seen this film before. That bit where she's standing on the bridge watching the sunset reminded me. Three. What should the woman do first? Well, you put the washing powder in the machine. Is that before or after you put the clothes in? Oh, it's after you put them in. And then remember to switch it on at the wall when you're ready. Now listen again. Well, you put the washing powder in the machine. Is that before or after you put the clothes in? Oh, it's after you put them in. And then remember to switch it on at the wall when you're ready. Four. What is David going to do this weekend? Could you help me paint my flat this weekend, David? Oh, sorry. I'm going sailing. I decided to enjoy myself for a change. I spent last weekend helping my mum do her garden, and I need to repair the car next weekend. Now listen again. Could you help me paint my flat this weekend, David? Oh, sorry. I'm going sailing. I decided to enjoy myself for a change. I spent last weekend helping my mum do her garden, and I need to repair the car next weekend. Five. How did the man get to work today? Sorry I'm late. I never know whether to take the underground or drive. I was held up in a traffic jam for half an hour, and then, when I got to work, the car park was full. I think I'll have to move nearer so I can walk or use my bike. Now listen again. Sorry I'm late. I never know whether to take the underground or drive. I was held up in a traffic jam for half an hour, and then, when I got to work, the car park was full. I think I'll have to move nearer so I can walk or use my bike. Six. Which tie does the man choose? Which tie shall I wear for the interview? Do you think my blue silk one would look all right? A bit boring. I'd wear something with a small pattern. Squares or spots. Something like that. Oh, I don't know. 
I think I'll wear the plain one. Now listen again. Which tie shall I wear for the interview? Do you think my blue silk one would look all right? A bit boring. I'd wear something with a small pattern. Squares or spots. Something like that. Oh, I don't know. I think I'll wear the plain one. Seven. What time is the appointment? Dr. Brown's clinic, can I help you? Yes. Can I have an appointment to see the doctor, please? Well, he's free at quarter past eleven today, or tomorrow at quarter past ten, or five to two. I'll come tomorrow afternoon. Thank you. Now listen again. Dr. Brown's clinic, can I help you? Yes. Can I have an appointment to see the doctor, please? Well, he's free at quarter past eleven today, or tomorrow at quarter past ten, or five to two. I'll come tomorrow afternoon. Thank you. That is the end of part one. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Finished? Okay, mm -hmm. what was the woman? Not yet. Not yet. Uh, yeah, yes. What was the woman's bag? Okay, it's letter B. Okay, the woman's bag is letter B. Which film is the man talking about? A O B. Letter B. Okay. What should oh, yeah. the woman do first? Letter C. Okay. And what is David going to do this weekend? Letter B. B. And how did the man get to work today? A. Letter A. And which tie does the man choose? Letter C. What time is the appointment? Letter C. Okay. okay, so this one, please try to hear an announcement about what is on television tomorrow? Okay, please listen. Now turn to part two. Questions eight to thirteen. You will hear an announcement about what's on television tomorrow. For each question, put a tick in the correct box. You now have 45 seconds to look at the questions for part two. Now we are ready to start. Listen carefully. You will hear the recording twice. And that's the weather forecast. And now we know what the weather is going to be like, let's have a look at what we've got for you tomorrow on TV 31. Most of the morning is taken up with children's television. As it's Saturday, we've got programs for children from the under fives to teenagers. We start the day at 7 with cartoons and programs for the very young. These go on until 9 when we have a film specially made for television called The Railway Princess. It was first shown about six months ago and we've had lots of requests to show it again. The film is based on Jenny Johnson's best-selling children's book. Then from 10.30 until 12 
we continue with a magazine program for 5 to 12 year olds. There's something for everyone. Animals, art, sport, the countryside. At lunchtime, from 12 till 2, we have something for teenagers. Here and now, our music program with all the latest groups and singers and the results of last week's competition. After lunch, there's half an hour of news and that's followed at 2.30 by sport. This afternoon, you can watch the match between Brazil and Ireland. The winner of that match will go on to play Italy or Spain in the final next week. Football is followed at 4 o'clock by tennis. We'll be watching part of the Macmillan tennis tournament. If the tennis is cancelled because of rain, we'll be going over early to Japan to see some of the skiing. Let's hope Angus Burns has recovered from yesterday's fall. At 5 o'clock, we'll be bringing you the end of the Round Britain cycle race. At 6 o'clock, it's time for our new quiz program. Your guess is as good as mine, with Nigel Parsons. Each team is shown pictures of people who were in the news in one particular year, or important things that happened in that year. The teams guess when that was. That's followed by more news, and at 7, it's time for our Saturday evening 